Hello Warriors, welcome back to your favorite fitness channel. As always remember to smash that like button and subscribe for more enlightening content. Today we're diving into the world of leg building. Strong legs are not just about aesthetics, they're vital for your overall fitness and health. They provide stability, improve your performance in other workouts, and can even prevent injuries. We've got some killer exercises lined up that will definitely make those muscles burn. So are you ready to transform your legs? Stay tuned and get ready to build those legs. First up, we have the Romanian deadlift, a classic move for targeting your glutes and hamstrings. Now the Romanian deadlift, or RDL as it's often abbreviated, is not just about lifting heavy, it's about engaging the right muscles, maintaining control, and most importantly, mastering your form. So how do you do a Romanian deadlift? Start by standing tall with your feet hip-width apart. Hold a barbell or a pair of dumbbells in front of your thighs, palms facing your body. Keep your shoulders back and your spine neutral. This is your starting position. Now push your hips back and start lowering the weight towards the ground. Make sure you keep the weight close to your body and your back straight. Lower the weight until you feel a stretch in your hamstrings. Then engage your glutes and push your hips forward to return to the starting position. That's one rep. The Romanian deadlift is a fantastic exercise for strengthening and toning your glutes and hamstrings. It also works your lower back and core, enhancing your overall strength and stability. In terms of sets and reps, if you're a beginner, start with 3 sets of 8 to 12 reps. As you get stronger, you can increase the weight and decrease the reps to really challenge your muscles. Remember, form is key in the Romanian deadlift, so take your time to get it right. It's not about how much you lift, but how well you lift, so keep your movements slow and controlled and always listen to your body. Next, we're moving on to the hip thrust, another great exercise for your glutes and hamstrings. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to thrust your way to a stronger lower body. An exercise that has taken the fitness world by storm, the hip thrust is a fantastic way to target your glutes and hamstrings. Let's break it down step by step. First, position your upper back against a bench with your feet firmly planted on the ground. Your knees should form a 90 degree angle. Now, here's where the magic happens. Brace your core, squeeze those glutes, and lift your hips towards the ceiling. Make sure your body forms a straight line from your shoulders to your knees at the top of the movement. Lower your hips back down and repeat. This is not just about lifting your hips, it's about activating those muscles. So remember to keep those hips high and squeeze those glutes at the top. It's this squeeze that will really fire up your muscles and give you that burn we all love to hate. As for the sets and reps, start with 3 sets of 12 reps. As you get stronger and more comfortable with the movement, you can increase the weight and decrease the reps for a more intense workout. The hip thrust is not just a great exercise for strengthening your lower body, but it also helps with improving your posture and reducing lower back pain. So get thrusting and take your leg day to the next level. Keep those hips high and squeeze those glutes at the top for maximum effect. Now, we're going to work on our quads with the barbell squat. Barbell squats are a powerhouse move, a real game changer when it comes to building strong, sturdy legs. They target your quadriceps, but also engage your entire lower body and core, making them an all-around fantastic exercise. The first thing you'll want to do is position the barbell on your upper back just below the neck. Keep your chest up, your eyes forward, and your feet shoulder width apart. This is your starting position. Now take a deep breath in and start to lower yourself as if you're sitting back into a chair. It's crucial to maintain a straight back throughout this movement. Imagine there's a string pulling you up from the crown of your head, keeping your spine long and tall. Go as deep as your flexibility allows, ideally until your thighs are parallel with the ground. This is where the magic happens. Push through your heels and explode back up to the starting position, exhaling as you rise. Barbell squats are not just about building muscle, they also improve your balance, mobility, and bone density. For a solid leg workout, we recommend doing 3 to 4 sets of 10 to 12 reps. Remember, it's not about how much weight you lift, but how well you lift it. So start light, master your form, and then gradually increase the weight. The barbell squat is a staple in leg workouts, so make sure to incorporate it into your routine. Scene script. Next up lunges, an excellent exercise for your quads. Lunges, ladies and gentlemen, an underrated but incredibly effective leg exercise. Whether you're a beginner or a seasoned gym goer, lunges should be a staple in your leg workout routine. Let's dive right in and learn how to perform them correctly. Firstly, stand tall with your feet hip width apart. This is your starting position. Now, take a step forward with your right foot. The distance should be about 2 feet or roughly the length of your leg. This is your stride length. 
As you step forward, lower your body until your right thigh is parallel to the floor and your right knee is directly above your ankle. Your left knee should hover just off the floor. This is the lunge position. Now push off your right foot and return to the starting position. Repeat the movement with your left leg. That's one rep. And remember, it's crucial to keep your front knee in line with your toes throughout the movement. This helps prevent knee injuries and ensures that your quads are doing the work. Lunges are fantastic for improving leg strength, balance, and coordination. They target your quads but also work your glutes, hamstrings, and calves. For beginners, try two sets of 10 reps. As you get stronger, you can increase the sets and reps or add weights for an extra challenge. There you have it, folks. Lunges in a nutshell. A simple but powerful exercise for building those leg muscles. Get lunging and feel the burn. Keep that front knee in line with your toes and you'll feel the burn in no time. Now let's not forget about our calves. We're going to work them out with calf raises. Calf raises are a fantastic exercise for strengthening and toning the lower leg muscles. They target the gastrocnemius and soleus muscles, which are crucial for activities like running, jumping, and even walking. So how do you do calf raises? Find a flat surface and stand tall with your feet hip width apart. Slowly raise your heels off the ground, pushing up onto your tiptoes. Hold this position briefly before slowly lowering your heels back to the floor. That's one rep. Now it's key to ensure a full range of motion. You want to really feel the stretch in your calves as you lower your heels and the contraction as you push up onto your tiptoes. As for sets and reps, start with three sets of 10 to 15 reps and build up as you grow stronger and more comfortable with the exercise. Calf raises might seem simple, but they're very effective when done correctly. Finally, we're going to finish off with single leg calf raises. This exercise is all about balance and control. To start, stand tall on one leg and lift the other foot off the ground. Now slowly raise the heel of your standing foot, pushing through the ball of your foot. Remember to keep your core engaged and your gaze forward to maintain balance. Lower your heel back down, and that's a single rep. It's a simple movement, but don't be fooled. Single leg calf raises are a powerful tool for strengthening your calves and enhancing your balance. So what's the magic number? A good starting point is three sets of 10 to 15 reps on each leg. As you get stronger, feel free to up the ante. Remember, it's not about speed, it's about control. Each raise and lower should be deliberate and measured. Single leg calf raises can be challenging, but they're great for building strength and balance. And that's a wrap, warriors. You now have a solid routine to build those legs. We've covered the Romanian deadlift, hip thrust, barbell squat, lunges, calf raises, and single leg calf raises. Each of these exercises target specific areas of your legs, ensuring a well-rounded and balanced workout. Remember, proper form and consistency are the keys to achieving your fitness goals. Thanks for tuning in, warriors. Remember to like, subscribe, and keep pushing your limits. Until next time, stay strong.